Hi guys and welcome to another every card on Ultimate Team by myself Bateson87. Today we're going to be looking at Francesco Totti, the uh, AS Roma captain and legend. Don't know how long he's got left in the tank but he's a very good player and he's had a lot of cards over Ultimate Team. So that's what we're going to be looking at today. Now if you guys do want any MSP, PSN codes or cheap game codes, make sure you do check out G2A.com. Their link is down below in the description. Use discount code BH7 to get a bit of a discount off. If we can try and hit over 4,000 likes this video, that'd be awesome. And subscribe if you are not already. Now if you guys do want to see your favourite players done in this series, make sure you do leave a comment down below. And if I've not done them already, I'll do them and hopefully you guys do enjoy it. Now there is a playlist if you go and find it on the channel somewhere. There's a playlist of all of them which we have done even though some of them have been got new cards so far this FIFA um, but it's something I can revisit every now and then so drop a like rating guys subscribe if you're not and with that said let's go and get into the players of Totti so his first batch of cards are his regular gold cards all the way from FIFA 09 all the way to FIFA 15. His 87 rated centre forward card in FIFA 09 looked absolutely ridiculous even with high pace. In FIFA 10 and 89 rated centre forward card and then obviously the usual drop in ratings. He went down to an 82 rated 70, um, centre forward sorry, um, pushing on 71 pace and then it went down even further in FIFA 12 drop into a 57 pace player then 32 pace player in FIFA 13 um, and then it actually did creep up a little bit uh, in the next FIFA jump into a 51 and then back down to a 40 in FIFA 15 really really strange drops but uh, Totti's been one of the best players around for a very very long time um, brilliant at passing brilliant at dribbling and also still scoring important goals especially for Roma even though they are in a bit of a difficult situation now so with that said there have been his regular gold cards from FIFA 09 to FIFA 15. Let's go and have a look at his informed versions. So we start off with an informed version. Informed version 91 rated centre midfielder, 78 pace, 92 shooting, 92 passing in FIFA 10. Absolutely sick looking card. In FIFA 13, he went all the way from an 84, well, 83, 84, 85. Actually, is this sound an 82? Then I can't remember. Um, 84 rated striker in FIFA 12 as well. Left wing card in FIFA 13. Uh, not very good pace but it was a nice card and uh, an informed version in FIFA uh, FIFA 14 and an informed version so far as well. Now a lot of people don't like to go near Totti's cards but honestly guys he is still very very good in game. A cracking shot very good at dribbling just lacking at pace and he, he's honestly it reminds me a lot like Perlo but in that attacking role. Slow pace but very very good stats on the rest of the card. So there have been his informed versions. Let's go and have a look at um, what other cards is there? Yeah there's a few more cards to come so let's go and have a look at them. So the only team the season card he's had was on FIFA 11, which was actually his, um, yeah, which was actually this one. Not a very, uh, not a very standout card. I think actually in the previous one. No, he didn't. So this was actually... Yeah, I thought he had a higher rated card, but he never. So an 87 rated centre midfielder, 78 pace, 91 shooting, 90 passing, 89 dribbling, and 62 defending, and uh, 65 heading. So not very good at heading, but yet again, as I've talked about it previously, the rest of his card stats are absolutely brilliant. So... Totti, he's not had any team of the years, he's not had any World Cup cards, so not that very many cards, but when they have come out, they've been very, very good to use. So let's go and have a look at some other cards. So with Totti obviously winding down in his career now, um, he probably is going to end up getting a legend prediction card, or well, legend card, in the future if EA can get the rights, whether it be, uh, well, a couple of years after he retires, or maybe even likes a FIFA 25 or something like that. Dreaming, but here we go. So this is legend prediction card, guys. He has got 77 pace, 88 dribbling, 88 89 shooting, which has always been high. Maybe I reckon they'll be a little bit higher as well, 89 passing. I reckon they'll be in the 90s for the shooting and passing. Um, but it's a nice looking card. Um, the Italians have got a few legend cards already, so adding one in the central midfield um, centre forward position will be absolutely brilliant, especially Totti. So with that said, that's his prediction. Let me know if you agree or disagree with it. And let's go and have a look at all his cards as a collective. So these are all his cards on Ultimate Team. 87 rated, 89 jumping all the way to his highest rated ever card, which was a 91 rated in FIFA 10 sick sick looking card um, and even like guys if you've got a couple of K like 20k I don't even know how much he is after price ranges definitely recommend going to try out that inform totty this year and if you still play FIFA 14 which I very, think very much is doubtful go and check out that 83 centre forward version as well it was a very very nice card a lot of people did I think last year was it yeah last year we had a cent 
I'm pretty sure he had a left wing card as well, but I wasn't sure which one it was. Maybe it was the FIFA 13 card, or maybe I'm completely wrong. But let me know anyway, guys. I think he had one card, which was a left wing. Maybe it was last year. Maybe one of these slides is wrong. But let me know in the comment section below. Anyway, so if you have enjoyed the video, like it very much appreciate it. Subscribe if you are not subscribed already. And also do check out the place of all the other cards. If you do want to see your favourite player, like I said, start the video, leave a comment down below and I'll aim to do it. And uh, remember to check out back all the other videos which I've done today. There has been a 95 rated player card, Griezmann, which you might guys may have missed, and also the best possible Valencia team, which you go and check out. Tomorrow morning, there's something else coming as well with a bit of uh, information on Ultimate Team, which you guys probably will enjoy. That'll be up in your sub boxes at around 8am. So make sure you check them out. Subscribe, comment, like, and I'll catch you all later. Have a very, very nice rest of your day.